As essential businesses, veterinary practices have had to adapt. Now, North Pole Veterinary Hospital is providing curbside service. Uh, we ask clients to wait out in the car with their patient, and then we have technicians and assistants who come out to the cars, retrieve the pets, bring them in for exam. The doctors then communicate with owners by telephone uh, during the exam process, and then in the end, um, we do take payment over the phone, credit card payments, and then the technician escorts the pet back out at the, after their exam is complete. One client, Laura Hughes, who brings her dog and two cats to North Pole Veterinary Hospital, says transitioning to the new service has been a little difficult. Just trying to maneuver with the change, uh, but as long as they're still seeing our pet, I am more than happy to sit outside and wait. I trust the vet with my dog inside without me. North Pole Veterinary Hospital's practice manager, Susie Nolan, says she thinks the transition has been going well. Clients have been absolutely fabulous, understanding and rolling with it. And it's a very strange time for everyone to navigate. And uh, our clients here at North Pole Veterinary have been wonderful about it. Nolan says they've been taking advice from national organizations as well as from the state level. Um, and taking those guidelines and putting them into practice um, so that we can still effectively do our jobs. When it comes to the worry of the virus being transmitted from the surface of a pet, Nolan says the studies show that is unlikely. But they are taking precautions when it comes to surfaces like pet carriers and leashes. When cats come in in carriers, we wipe those hard surfaces down with um, disinfectant. Um, we try to use our hospital leashes as opposed to owner-based leashes and uh, just minimize any sharing of any kind of equipment like that. Veterinarians, clients, and patients all navigating this new normal.